Realise we haven't taken any videos today. <laughs> getting pretty slack now. Yeah, getting pretty slack. All we're doing is just sitting by the sea. Stephanie says hi. And uh, yeah, had some breakfast, had some cocoa pops and some watermelon. Steph had mashed potato because she's a fucking deviant. <laughs> Look at that mashed potato face and uh yeah just sitting by sitting by the sea there's a lot of storm clouds on the horizon i feel we've done some very boring vlogs over the last few days yeah been very boring the last few days but i've enjoyed it so don't really care bit of lunch again weather's cleared up burger i quite like these burgers Steph's got, I think, a chicken Kiev, and it's nice. Nice sauce. Come for some dinner at a buncha place. It says it right there. In, oh, it's not. Oh, I can't zoom in. Buncha, and Stephanie is very excited because she had some buncha in Hanoi, and she's been bumming it off ever since. More like bumcha. Steph said that was a hilarious joke. And said that Dave doesn't look like he's enjoying any trip. I am enjoying this. Stephanie's going to eat her buncha. Stephanie doesn't have any soul. If you can't eat anything that doesn't have soul in it. Eat your buncha. Eat your buncha. How are you going to eat it? Noodles? Yeah. Greens? Take a little bit of noodle. Get it all juicy and smother it up. Nice dinner at that place there. And it was alright, although I am getting a bit bored now of uh, noodles and soup. Uh, but it was only £6, so it was really cheap. So now we've come for gelato at the place opposite. We've got the same as I did. But looking forward to it a lot more. I didn't take um, an end video yesterday, so just gonna merge the two together because we've been a bit slack with taking videos since we've been in Fukuok. Um, ooh, some thunder. Um, today we have come out to Starfish Beach, which is a big beach. And in the distance there, you can see behind that pier, some Cambodian islands, lots of white sand, and apparently, starfishes. It's the starfish lake, water, beach, whatever it's called. Got some starfishes. Got some starfishes. Annoyingly, and it's something we had read about, is that lots of Asian tourists, like those two over there, which we just saw doing it, will take the starfishes out of the water to take a photo. So we just went over and shouted at them and just put all the starfishes back in the water again. <laughs> then if you want a photo with them and you have to arrange them, just do it in the water. <laughs> Stupid. Starfish. All of these starfish here, uh, those two girls had out on the beach there and they all started curling up. And uh, yeah, I just went in. Shouted at them. Well, Steph shouted at them. <laughs> I was the muscle. <laughs> <laughs> but it's such a beautiful place and it's just being ruined by twats. We've gone for a walk at the beach and there's loads of these like brainy bits of sand. It's what all these lumps are. And it's obviously summer has made it. But I do not know what and it's a bit creepy. So we've, um, we've came back from Starfish Beach. Uh, we didn't stay too long, because uh, uh, <laughs> pretty shit to be honest. And Stephanie's not feeling 100%. So we decided to come back. Um, it was just really dirty and the tide was in. So you can even see that many starfish. And the beach was really dirty and loads of Asian tourists just picking up and playing with the starfish, which was a bit 
off. So uh, yeah, we've come back. Our toilet was broke, it wasn't flushing properly, uh, the cistern wasn't filling up and they filled that, they fixed that, so we've got a working toilet. Stephanie is having a dump as we speak, and then we are just going to relax on our own little beach today. And it's gonna be nice. stopped um, got a few hours till dinner yeah. and so we are how I call having a brewski Stephanie's got a bit of a cold brewing so I fear that it's not gonna be a good next few days is it say so how are you feeling rubbish. feeling rubbish so come out for dinner at a lobster place Never really had lobster before. Just intrigued as to what it'll be like, but excited as well. How are you feeling? So we just leave. Just leaving. Just leaving the restaurant. Yeah. That place there. Um, the food was really, actually, quite nice. The sauce was good, but it was a full lobster. I've never had lobster before. Steph's only ever had it when it's been prepared and neither of us had a clue what we were doing and it's up there with Da Nang as just an awkward eating experience. There's very little meat on lobster, I've learned. <laughs> and it cost us about 50 quid. <laughs> nice. Uh, Absolutely but... decimated that poor lobster. And then I couldn't even eat half of it because its eyes were staring at me. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so we live and we learn. But like I said, it was nice and it wasn't the restaurant's fault that we are noobs. So we came to, it's called a snow bar. Yeah, it's just an ice cream place. I've got some of this like, called Hokkaido. Um, Steph's telling me it looks like something in the Philippines when I'm supposed to mix it. Uh, it looks like something you've dragged out of a pond. <laughs> Steph's making a horrible face about her smoothie. But we'll see how it goes. Ice cream has peas in it. That's why I. Nice. Yeah. So we found a bar. Uh, uh, that Sunset Sea Bar. Uh, we only stayed for one because it was one of the weirdest places. Very creepy vibe. Mm -hmm. uh, three topless men singing uh, karaoke, and one. I don't even know if he worked there or not, but he just kept staring at us <laughs> all the time. And the karaoke was turned up to 11, so you can hear yourself think. And it was all just in fitting with the day, really. <laughs> the day's been a bit underwhelming and very expensive. <laughs> so we're gonna go back now and have a cheap wine. Carrying on with the weird vibe of the day. Um, our taxi driver was uh, either half asleep or drunk or had just had a massage uh, because he didn't really seem to want to pick us up and when he knew we were there he didn't really was in a hurry and he left after talking quite heavily with two people from a massage parlor um, I mean he got us here safe and sound and he didn't overcharge us but it's just weird <laughs> this day is weird back in the room end of the day Weird day, uh, expensive day. Looking forward to not doing anything tomorrow. Last day. Last day. Mm -hmm. We're gonna sleep with no alarm and it's gonna be the best. <laughs> 